This October, you're invited to mark the 100th anniversary of a classic horror story. And you know, even if you don't recognize its name, you will likely recognize its villain. Jane, it's a silent film. That's right, and some musicians from Greenville have composed music to match the movie. Our Gabrielle Komorowski reports. <laughs> A sound can paint a picture. The mice get this sound. And give goosebumps. It's the spooky specialty of the Greenville based musical duo called Valentine Wolf. Sarah Black and Braxton Ballou are husband and wife. Braxton played for us in the Hughes Main Library's Goodnight Moon Story Room. The music we play sometimes it's very uh, cinematic and dark. Using an electric upright bass and Sarah's soprano voice. Inspiration has come from the gothic novel Frankenstein, the poems of Emily Dickinson, and a silent film from 100 years ago called Nosferatu. One of the uh, all-time classic movies of silent film and silent horror. This is essentially Dracula. This vampire is Count Orlock. A famous scene from the film shows his shadow climbing stairs. When this silent film was first shown to audiences 100 years ago, Braxton says music was performed live in the theater and improvised. Open. And that is how Valentine Wolf will perform their haunting music. When you're performing, you want to take the audience on an adventure ride with you. You are invited to watch and listen. That's what Valentine Wolf is, that thrill and that chill in the air in October. Notes to narrate iconic images that are still spooky 100 years later. Gabrielle Komorowski, WYFF News 4.